One, two, three. Now this is George Kuchar, Kuchar Combines out of Carlinville, Illinois. Uh, we got a new rotor out that's uh, very awesome. What it is is uh, we got our bars that are <coughs> nine inches instead of a six inch bar. We're running four of them instead of uh, five of them through there. We got <coughs> 36 inches of thrash on them bars where the John Deere and uh, and my other bars only had uh, 30 inches, so we got six inches more a uh, row for thrashing, which it thrashes a lot better. On this rotor here, and we got a step in the middle, and the reason we got the step in the middle is to get the thing to uh, separate on the outside, because it's uh, bigger on the outside in the back than it is in the front. When the material hits the front of this rotor, it takes uh, three seconds, and it will be out the back. That's a lot, a lot longer we keep it in the machine. With Deer, and this is their bullet rotor here, uh, it takes uh, 12 seconds from the time it hits the front till the time it goes out the back. That's why, they, that's why they beat it up so long. They keep it too long in the machine. We don't keep it that long in the machine. The material will come out of the back end as long as this stuff is cut off and everything rubbed out the head of that. It does give you a better uh, Job of thrashing, easier on fuel, and a better sample and hopper.